That asked, would you guys be actually see yourself dating somebody, somebody like me? No. <laughs> <laughs> so wait till the mic gets you, and then um, if you can answer why, please. <laughs> me? <laughs> I would not. Um, I don't think you're healthy. Absolutely. Um, you're physically not my type. But um, what if they all say no? Oh, yeah, oh, wow. yeah, I'm also gonna pass. What do you say? I just um, personally couldn't do it. Oh my! <laughs> Wait, neon, neon. Hold on. I just, don't, I just don't think you're my type. No, absolutely. Neon, neon, neon. I'm gonna pass as well in the most respectful way. I just mm -hmm. think you're um, like very. Stick out further than your dicky do. Oh Y'all, dude, what the fuck, <laughs> bro? Yeah! <laughs> I would. And why? Yeah! Cause I don't give a fuck! Wait, what? Alright, bro. They are uh, respectful now for me. Absolutely. Uh, no. I wanted to laugh at this video, but this video is kind of bad watching it. But why would you sign yourself up for this? We've created a society where now we can't even tell fat people that they're fat anymore. Apparently, it's a taboo to call people fat. I will say they went a bit far with it, but I guess he did sign up for it. And yes, I said he. Before we get back into the video, I need all of you to turn on your post notifications so that you get notified when one of my videos come out. Subscribe to the YouTube channel like the video if you enjoyed the video comment down below i'll try and reply to as many comments as possible and follow me on instagram and twitter at yinka that guy let's get back into the video equal pay because it's like why am i going to college i'm getting a's and b's and this nigga got c's all right let me, let me, more let money me, than let me. would you rather have a high profile job for no pay or clean sewers for a hundred thousand dollars a year i would clean sewers if it's more money okay do you think most women would choose to do that um i don't know what what, what, what most women choose but i'm talking about me okay no i get that but i'm saying i've interviewed hundreds of women and most women actually would not choose a dangerous, dirty job. Is that possibly why a lot of women get paid less? Why do we have the expression, that's a man's job? Because certain things are a man's job. Because it's like, why gotta take the trash out if there's a man in the house? Right, so I'm or just saying- lift heavy things. Well, is it fair to say if you want equal privileges, you need equal responsibilities? No, I want, why is responsibilities with equality? Because you gotta I'm just take, trying to get equal pay. Because you gotta take why the bad with the good. Why guys have equal pay? Don't you have to take the bad with the good? No, you do not. We should have equality, period. You see what I mean? You know what I mean? So you want equality only when it benefits you? How much should a guy earn for you to date him? Over 500k, close to a million. If he doesn't, I'm not gonna say yes. Do you hear me? How much should a guy pay for the engagement ring? He needs to pay again. 500. He gets paid every year. 500. He saves that towards the ring. If he doesn't, he's gonna get a no, and it's gonna be embarrassing. <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. Maybe not a 10, let's not go that far, but like definitely an 8 per. What you think the vast majority me, of like, people? Like if I rated myself 1 to 10, I give myself a 5. I think I'm normal looking. Mm -hmm. And I, I just think it's based on my results. I think if I was an 8, 9, or 10, I would have had modeling contracts. <laughs> because people in the top 20% of beauty, they get they get modeling contracts. But mm -hmm. what is beauty? <laughs> so what, what is beauty? I mean, there's a lot of things. Like if you... I mean, you can you can go online and have people rate your pictures, and they, they rank you one to ten. And girls say like, "I'm an eight because," or sometimes I hear girls say ten. Cause I, I hear this a lot where they say like, "Because I love myself and I'm like confident now." But don't you think attractiveness is based on results? Mm. They may be, but I don't care about those results. To okay. be honest, just imagine the roles were reversed, and this was a man saying what this woman is saying, who was the same size as this woman. Trust me, people will be in the comment section shaming her, but for some reason, you're not fat, you're curvy. I think it's okay to transition children? Yeah. To Christianity? No. Ladies and gentlemen, we got him. How much money do you think a guy should make per year? It'd be nice if they were at least making a hundred thousand. Like a million? Two million? Okay. Three hundred K. Three figures. Okay. So why is that? Just cause like 
That's a stable income, I'd say. 100, like 500 grand? Is that a lot? Uh, a lot were expensive. Yeah. Mills. Millions. Oh, Mills. Yeah. I don't really care. I made 30K a year. Is that something you're okay with? Yeah, that, I think that would be great. Like this is the dated market in today's society in the West. I hope people caught on what one of these women just said. Three figures is a stable income. These are the women that are in the dating market in the West. You gotta like drive for everything they have. Make their money, their car, their house, their energy, yeah. their motivation. Waste their time. Their faith. Waste their time. By the time we're done, they wanna Have you ever cheated? For sure. I have. Yes. <laughs> Absolutely. I have. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I have. It was a very good time. <laughs> it was like a one night thing and then a one night thing and it turned into a two year thing. He cheated on me 14 times, so, you know, I'm not going to be. Yeah, it was just once, right? Yeah. yeah. You had to get him back. I had to get him yeah. back. You really don't know if you love someone until you cheat on them. Yeah. Because then if you, like, feel bad after, yeah. then you're like, oh, I love them. Yeah. So when did you find that out? I cheat on everybody and I don't feel bad. So. Tell me, have you ever cheated? Have you ever cheated? <laughs> have you guys ever cheated on one of your guys with one of his friends? Yes, okay, so I, I just had a boyfriend, like my last boyfriend. He's actually down on 6th Street. Yeah. I was with his friend, like I was with his whole friend. That kid did not care, he still stayed with me. And so what would you say on average a guy will spend on you? Or oh just my whatever, God. your career or whatever? Maybe like 10, 10,000, easy. Over how long? Uh, mine would probably be like six months. Yeah, something like that. Damn. Yeah. You know, you spend it like it's yours, right? Yeah, because we earned it. I'm not spending mine. Yeah, and you yeah, still like cheat on them too, right? I mean, yeah. yeah. I honestly feel sorry for some of the men in today's day in world in the West. These are the options they have to choose from. People who celebrate cheating. This is society today. Y'all trust each other 100%? Yes. Yeah. May we test that theory? By doing what? Swapping phones. Okay. Yeah. Let's get it. Let's get it. Let's go through uh, Snapchat. Is that a phone true? Yeah. All right. We'll go through her phone first. It's on this side. Uh, why me first? I mean, because you're on my side, just make it more no, quicker. Let's do, let's do the man first. All right, well, then we're going to get to her phone, I guess. Let's right. do the man first. Let's get it. All we're going right. to go Snapchat. Hey, you better not be deleting stuff. Oh, I'm going to peep it. Oh, oh, he good on that. I need to take this call. My mom's calling. You got to take a call? Suspicious activity. I mean, it's a, it's a faithful guy right here, you know what I'm saying? So he passed. Hey, hey, what's the whispering? Uh, my mom called me. I can't. I can't. She can't do this right now. I, I like, actually can't. Why, why can't we go through your Snapchat? Because I need to go. But that's a little suspicious activity. Yeah. What's your advice to to all the unhealthy relationships? Get her, bro. She leaving. <laughs> bro, why, why, she be, why she being like that, bro? Don't you find that was low-key weird, though? Uh, not really. I, I, I think it was something serious. That. Like, damn, she gone. No, she had to go. So men really need to start getting some respect for themselves because this is honestly disgraceful behavior. He's laughing and we all know inside he's really dying inside and it's absolutely sad that someone has to go through this type of rubbish. She has an 11 year old. She identifies right now as transgender. Cause I'm like, you can wake up and be whoever you want to be whenever you wake up and that's fine. She admits that she's not sure what she wants and how she identifies, but she knows that it's not like everybody else. Yeah, well, I'm not like the other girls. And that's why we just use everything that's just very fluid yeah. because you can change your mind. Enabler, 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 enabler. Would you date a plus size girl? No. Why? It's just not, not appealing to the eyes. Plus, uh, I'm a kinesiology major. <laughs> so it's like I hit the gym every day, run every day, and it's like, and especially for me, I don't know for other people, but since like activity is my lifestyle, I'm gonna need to keep up with me, honestly okay. speaking. I don't wanna go into the science of it, but there is ways to lose the weight, but uh, find a way. There's always a way. This guy got asked a question on his dating preferences and he said he would not date a fat girl. The crazy thing about this video is people in the comment section were shaming him for his own preference. Society has lied to women so much that they believe being fat is attractive. Can you explain what an incel is? So an incel is just like someone who is involuntarily celibate. 
that loser sitting on Reddit for 23 hours a, a day um, with Cheetah Dust and empty Mountain Dew cans all around them. And it just has a real stank smell that is involved with these people. Perfect. Because I'm just going to page you an image. And, like, the fedora is a little yeah. crusty. And the the beard, the, the neck beard is strong. But the facial hair is weak. And there's a bald spot in the back. And you can just, and you can just see the fedora just hanging on for dear life. And he's sitting there mutter, muttering under his breath about how, like, Jessica Alba's uh, ugly. Right. You know, Literally. like, yeah. that's what you're talking about. <laughs> The funny thing is, I don't necessarily blame women like her saying the things she's saying with the way she looks. The reason she's able to speak so confidently is because we have some men who are still actually hitting up a girl like her. So she's got the confidence to talk the way she's talking. Because as I usually say, if this was on the opposite end and this was a man saying this, he would be dragged on social media. Men need to step their game up and stop allowing this type of behavior to run riot on social media. 